Small molecule compounds can be used in many ways to regulate stem cell fate. Small molecules are often used to modulate key signaling pathways involved in the self renewal and differentiation of pluripotent stem cells, as well as in the generation of induced pluripotent stem cells. When prepared and stored properly, small molecules are highly stable and are simple to use in cell culture applications. Small molecules function in a dose dependent manner, which provides a unique point of control over an experiment. This tutorial will review the basic workflow for using small molecules in the stem cell laboratory. Step 1. Prepare a concentrated stock solution. Lyophilized small molecules must first be reconstituted in an appropriate solvent to make a concentrated stock solution. Dimethyl sulfoxide, or DMSO, is often used as an initial solvent because it lends to the increased stability of the frozen small molecule solutions over time. To prepare a concentrated stock solution, add the appropriate amount of DMSO to the entire contents of the vial to make a 10 millimolar or a 1000x solution. Vortex the vial for approximately 10 to 20 seconds to be sure that all of the lyophilized powder is dissolved. Most small molecules should easily go into solution after the initial vortexing step. If the compounds are not fully resuspended at this point, warm the vial in a 37 degrees Celsius water bath for approximately 5 minutes. After this short incubation and repeated vortexing, the compounds should be completely dissolved. Step 2. Aliquot and store. Once the small molecule compound has been completely resuspended, the concentrated stock solution can be aliquoted into smaller volumes and stored at minus 20 degrees Celsius. Preparing multiple aliquots will prevent the entire stock solution from degradation due to repeated freeze-thaw cycles. Resuspended compounds are stable for six months when stored at minus 20 degrees Celsius. Step 3. Dilute to the final working concentration in medium. When ready to use, thaw one vial of the concentrated stock solution at room temperature to prepare a diluted working solution in medium. Small molecules are generally added fresh to the cell culture medium as needed. Because the compounds are more sensitive to degradation when diluted and incubated at 37 degrees Celsius, it is best to prepare a fresh solution for each medium change. Dilute the small molecule concentrated stock solution further directly in medium just prior to filtering. The compounds should be filtered at their final working concentration in medium. A 0.22 micron pore size filter is recommended. Store any unused concentrated stock solution at minus 20 degrees Celsius. Avoid repeated freeze-thaw cycles to preserve the integrity of the compound over time. For a library of StemGent video protocols or to download a PDF of this protocol, please visit StemGent.com.